Harry and Meghan's harsh repercussions for damage caused is holding royal family together. Meghan Markle and Prince Harry have not shied away from talking about royal life, and one expert believes this is irreversible. Hello viewers. If you're new here, please don't forget to subscribe and click the notifications bell, so you don't miss any news about the British royal family. It is believed that this caused no damage. The Duke and Duchess of Sussex launched a series of attacks on the firm when they stepped down from their roles as senior working royals in 2020. Prince Harry accused his brother Prince William of yelling during the tense confrontation. Meanwhile, Duchess Meghan shocked the world when she said she had been silenced by the royal family. Prince Harry and Meghan Markle's insistence that their relationship with the firm fell apart, but after King Charles was diagnosed with cancer, there were rumors that he would return to England. But PR expert Ryan McCormick believes the Sussexes are unlikely to return to the royal family. He spoke exclusively to the Mirror. In Mario Puzo's book Family he writes, We are a family and family loyalty must be prioritized above everything and everyone else. For if we keep that promise, we will never lose but if we waver in that loyalty, we will all be judged. I think this quote speaks volumes about the current state of the royal family. By betraying intimate secrets and publicly defaming their own flesh and blood, Meghan Markle and Prince Harry have caused irreparable damage to this more than 1,200-year-old organization, and are calling for other members to speak out. I think there is a possibility that we will encourage them to raise their prices. Other family members may also have the courage to leak dirt to the press, knowing they won't have to fear the consequences. Ryan's comments come after Prince Harry paid the reserve. It comes after he admitted he had plans to return to the UK to visit his father last month. The Duke of Sussex met King Charles and the couple chatted for 30 minutes. During an interview on Good Morning America, Harry said we are also planning other trips. They take me around England, they take me to England. He also admitted that he still loves his family. Look, I love my family and I'm grateful that I was able to get on a plane and visit him and spend time with him, Prince Harry said. I'm back, said the royal critic of Prince Harry and Meghan Markle. The Duke and Duchess of Sussex have stood out from other royals since moving to America and stepping back from royal duties. The rift deepened after the couple made explosive claims about the firm in both an Oprah Winfrey interview and a Netflix documentary. Last year, Harry added fuel to the fire by publishing his memoir Spare, in which he shot and killed several members of his family. The situation worsened when Omid Scobie, a royal author and ex-boyfriend of Meghan Markle, published his book Endgame, in which he revealed details of the royal race dispute. Columnist Sarah Vine previously claimed Prince Harry's and Princess, and could be the answer to all the problems in the royal family.